Hello, um, today I'm going to be doing another tutorial on Linux and I'm going to be showing you today how to install, upgrade and update um, your programs and operating system. Um, I will be using apt because that is what I use for default on Ubuntu. Um, it's the main package management system on Debian based systems. Um, other or, um, distros Linux distros will use different package management systems like Yum on Fedora and Red Hat based systems. So let's get started. Um, I'm going to show you how to install a package. Um, it's quite easy. We're, I'm going to use sudo because you need some sort of root access to install programs. So it's just apt-get then install and then I'm going to install a program called um, Emma, which is a database application. Um, so I'm going to type in Emma. You can tab complete if it it will um, beep if there's more than one thing, um, one option it can complete. And then if you double tap tab, you will get an options. Um, so just Emma. It will now install the package. There we go. Quite quick. So now I can open Emma. You won't be able to see this, but um, hopefully, there's there it is Emma. I'll close that. Um, and you can install anything within the repositories, the um, basically big databases of software um, that you connect to. Um, you can also remove um, software using apt-get, but you use sudo apt-get remove and then you type in the name of the program you want. Also got tab completion. So I'll, I'll ask you, these will be the packages that you want removed. Um, as you can see here, the following packages were automatically installed and are no longer required. Python, MySQL, DB. Use apt-get auto-remove to remove them. So first we'll remove Emma, the database app. There we go, removed. Now I will use um, the auto remove feature to clean up any dependencies that aren't actually needed anymore. So we'll continue. There we go. So that's the basics of installing and removing software. Next is quite simple is apt-get update and apt-get upgrade. Um, update will update your software list. So as I show you now, a long list of the archives that I connect to and it will read the package lists and check that they're up to date. Um, then to actually upgrade your software you use apt-get upgrade. And so now if I press enter it will give me a list of the packages that will be upgraded and ask me do you want to upgrade so I'll select yes this time and it will download each of the packages that are to be upgraded. It will prepare the packages and then it will install them. There we go. So that's the basics of using apt, apt-get. There are other, other things. You've got the graphical um, add and remove programs um, program available on Ubuntu. And, uh, I'm sure you can't see much here. Um, but that's it. In which you can search for packages. Um, and two different categories. Um, that's quite easy. You've also got the more less graphical, but well, it's actually still graphical, but it's a bit more advanced. Is the um, Synaptic Package Manager. Um, let me just enter my password. Uh, that's a bit more complicated, but it's um, it's much more advanced and better for searching for packages. But I find the command line as shown to be much more convenient because it's just quick, and it, all the information is there for you, and it's it doesn't take up too many resources. And that's it. Uh, thank you for watching.